Hey guys, Moose here. Welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark. We are carrying a dead flare for some reason. I don't actually know how to put it down, even though I remember we figured out how to uh, just do that, holster it. I figured it out in the last playthrough of this game that I did, not on camera, but the one I did for fun a little while ago. It was like three or four months ago I was playing it. And now I don't remember, so... Oh well. Anyway, down we go. I like going down. Down is good. Down means I'm leaving the mountains potentially, so let's continue on this way. If you don't if you didn't watch the previous episode, we went that way and hit the end of this ravine. So now we're going this way. Because ravines generally have two or more directions you can go in. Well, no, that's they always do. But anyway, you get the idea, we're going the other way. Seeing where it leads. I'm sure it goes somewhere couldn't possibly also be a dead end. That would be horrible. Said it before, but I wouldn't mind finding a mine entrance down here. That would give me somewhere to walk through to get to a new area, and hopefully it would not be the stupid farming area, which I would absolutely hate. Okay, this continues down, but I'm going to head over here real quick, because this looks like a little area where something might be hidden. I wish I could just directly set the trees on fire. Okay, this will help with a fire if I decide to make one, which I think I might. It's certainly a tempting proposition at this point. Heat up a little, get a little food. I don't really need food, but my condition is dropping below 70 now, so... Let's go ahead and do that, actually. Yeah, you're fine. Okay. Looks good to me, let's make it happen. I don't think I'm going to bother cutting up any of the other wood. I'm just going to stick with this. So I don't think I want to cut up any more branches here. This should be fine. We do have a pretty good number of sticks, you know. Looks like we made it, but I'm not sure. It could still fail. I've seen it fail later. Yep. Oh, no, it didn't fail. Okay. There we go. Let's heat up some coffee. Might want to get some herbal tea, too. Yeah, let's go for it. We got the stuff. We might as well make some tea. Every little bit helps. Okay, we'll drink the coffee first. Then I will drink the tea. And then I will eat dog food. Actually, no, I won't, because that actually has water in it, I think. So we will eat the jerky. There we go. All right, we're feeling pretty good. I'm just going to wait here a moment longer. And I'm going to do that by... Yeah, uh, let's do half a liter. I don't want to be out here too long. I really would like to leave this uh, spot and continue on as quickly as possible because there's only so many hours of daylight and we have no clue where we're going. And I'm actually going to make one more cup of coffee, though. Even though it won't be hot by the time we drink it, the caffeine will help. There we go. Alright, let's bail. We're warm, so time to leave. Alright, well, that was a pretty effective fire. Pretty much resolved what we needed it to resolve. Our condition is going up very slightly. Not as quickly as I'd like, but, you know, what are you going to do? All right. Starting to walk kind of slow here. Not really thrilled about that, but, you know, that's life. Definitely tiring us out having so much stuff, but not really comfortable throwing anything we have away. I'm going to start collecting sticks again in case we decide we want another fire. 
And we may need one. Sleeping outside is going to be... Ooh, there's an engine. Sleeping outside is going to be a not great proposition, so... I'm not really in a position where I could backtrack to the cabin, even though I know the way. What I'm really worried about is that by going in this ravine, we've actually done a loop. And we're back to where we started in this area, and that is going to cause us problems if that is the case. But I cannot recall if we've been here before. I think we maybe have. It's difficult to say. No, it says new location, so... I think I have to go that way, up there. But I'm gonna go this way first. That was a mistake. Could you not, though? I'm gonna use a flare. You want some of this? Yeah, that's what I thought, motherfucker. Why are you running around me? Come on. What are you, stupid? Dumb wolf. Alright, that was worth it. I don't really want to deal with any further injuries here. Even though they're not really that big of a deal, I just don't want to fuck around. Really? You're back for more already? Don't make me get my gun out. Because I will, and you will not enjoy it. Even though I will probably miss every shot. You will not enjoy getting shot at. Where are you? Oh, there you are. I still got the flare, dude. Like, nothing's changed. Just because I'm by your tree that you pissed on doesn't mean you should be coming back and growling at me. Alright, well, we'll see if there's another corpse over here, maybe. I don't think there is. Yeah, there's no no birds, so let's just go. It's going to be an uphill slog, but I don't really see the alternative here. We need to go. Bottom line. Don't really have much of a choice. Push forward, that's all we can do. Really? You're still following me? Are you stupid? I think you're stupid. Whatever. It's not stupid enough to come close to me, so I think eventually he's just gonna buzz off, but for now he still... still wants to follow me, see what I'm doing. That's fine. If you want to be dumb, that's on you. We are making surprisingly quick progress up this hill. Thought it would take a lot longer to get up here. I thought we would be going much more slowly. Is that a cave? That is a cave! It's a dwelling. I could stay here if there's no bear. I don't think there's a bear. Nice. Alright, well, it's inside. There could be wolves or bears in here, but that's fine. We'll deal with it. I mean, it's not, it's the opposite of fine, but... Okay. Can't see too well. I'm a little concerned by this. Uh, let's do this so that we can actually see what's going on here. There we go, much better. I'm not going to take coal. I don't need it. It's nice, but now's not the time. It's heavy. We don't have space. This is an odd little uphill trek. Going inside the mountain. Not a dead end, either. Continuing uphill. Very surprising. Well, this will be fun at the very least. I don't think I've ever been in a cave like this. Yep, off we go. 
It kind of reminds me of the Solus Project a little bit. Even though I've never played it, I've watched playthroughs of it, and I've seen people walking through caves that look different, obviously, but uh, not that different. Tree stuff. Okay, that's a little surprising. Continuing a pill. What do we got up here? A large open room. A very large open room. Someone was here. You got anything for me, buddy? How'd you get snow on you in here? Okay. T-shirt's not worth much. Really just cloth, but... Yeah, don't play suspenseful music in the fucking caves, okay? This isn't a horror game. Don't try to be one. Don't do it again. Come on. Alright, let's head up the walkway here. Oh, this is not a walkway. My mistake. How do I get up there? No, there is a walkway. I just missed it. No, there goes the flare, like, way behind us. Still have a good amount of energy, so that's good to see. Are we going to get to the mountain summit by doing this? That would be very weird. Unexpected is what the word that I would use. This seems like a good way to die. One of those rocks falling out as you step on it. Ah, daylight. And we have gone up, which is kind of not what I was looking for, but, you know, exploration. We'll see what's up here. Maybe there is a cabin at the top of the mountain. Should be a very weird place to build a cabin and very difficult to get wood to, but, you know, maybe. You never know. We will find out momentarily. Put that away. Uh-oh. More jet parts. No way. Are we... No, we're not in the same area. Of course not. But there's a river here. That's kind of interesting. Other engine. Looks like it fucked up some of the trees. Can't really see too well. Not sure this is the way that I wanted to go in the cave. Ooh, there's stuff here. No, those are just rocks. Disregard, that is not stuff. Okay. Well, we got excited briefly. Let's continue in this direction, for lack of a better option. If we get caught outside at night, we're probably totally fucked, but, you know, whatever. What are we supposed to do about that at this point? It's not like we're going to make it back to the to the mountain cabin. The stone cabin, or whatever you want to call it. I don't... What was it called? I don't remember. Rocks seem like a not great insulator. You'd probably rather have wood, right? If you're looking for a cabin. I know, uh, duh, cabins are made out of wood, but... Uh, is that deliberate for temperature reasons? I think wood is better insulation than... Uh, than rock, but I could be totally wrong about that. Ooh, dead deer. Let's go ahead and use that. Well, do we want to? Uh, I don't think we have room. But I could cook it. No. We gotta continue on. So we don't have anywhere to stay, and we cannot stay here. Okay, this scares me a little, because it doesn't appear like there's anywhere to go once I go down, but let's find out. That looks like a cliff face, which would be a serious problem. That is a cliff face, which is a serious problem. Maybe there's a rope. There's a mountaineering rope. I can make it work. Oh. 
Or maybe somewhere to use my rope. Is that the ravine? This is totally where we came from. Okay. Right? We went up that way, and then there was the entrance, and then we went up here. Okay, I understand where we are now, kind of. So... I seem to have made a horrible decision by going up in the cave. I would kind of like to go back to the cave because the cave was safe. The cave didn't have wolves or assholes of any variety, just dead people, which is totally, totally workable. Given that I have food, the ability to sleep, and the ability to make fire, I think I need to be in the cave until I can find a way out of it that puts me somewhere tenable, because I don't think there's going to be any housing up here. I think this is the hard mode area, and I need to not be in it. So let's head back, even though coming up is going to be kind of a problem. Probably going to cause us to be winded, but I don't really see much of an alternative here. Plus, the other thing is if it's dark in the cave, it's like, well, it's already dark. Who gives a shit? Okay, so I know where I need to go in the cave, kind of. The question is, do I expect that I'm going to spend the night there? No, but... I want feathers, and I want sinew. There should be feathers here. Come on. Where are the feathers? Broken arrow. No feathers. All right. No, don't want hide. I want guts. Why are you using the hatchet for this? This is a hunting knife application for sure. All right. We'll pass on the rest. We really need meat. We're okay right now. Where was the cave entrance? Back, yeah, okay, back this way. Alright, I remember where we are. Oh, man. I do not want to be this high up. We need to get back down to sea level for sure, because that's where most of the housing is going to be, which is what we're looking for here. Unless that's a house. I think that was just a rock. It's behind trees right now, but... Uh, yeah, that's probably just a rock. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely just a rock. At the, at the best case scenario, that's plane debris, and we can't do anything with plane debris. So, whatever. We shall continue through the cave as planned. I'm going to take a quick peek in the other direction, away from the engine, and see if there's anything I care about over there, but I don't think so. I think we really just want to be back in the cave here. Because there's no way anyone builds their house up here. It just doesn't make sense. I'm like 99% sure this is the hard mode area. Which I am definitely not prepared for in any way. Hey, it's a rabbit. Yeah, I don't have a bow to kill you with, so I'm kind of SOL on that. Doesn't really do anything for me. I believe that's the cave entrance, but I could be mistaken. This fog isn't really doing me any favors either. It's kind of cool that there's a river here. I think I see, like, a moose or something in the distance, but it's hard to say. Let's just take a quick peek here. Downed tree. Some rocks. That's kind of it. Nope, that's not an animal. It's just a rock. There's a rabbit, but again, no bow. Nothing we can do. All right, back into the cave. Well, at least it'll be easier to go downhill in there than it was to come up. Not that it was particularly difficult to come up. Wonder if that's the summit. I would like to go to the summit someday. It'd be kind of cool. See what the game has to offer up there would be pretty interesting. All right, down we go. Oops. Get our lantern out. Okay, and let us continue our journey. 
Don't have much fuel for it, but I have more. I can actually, you know what? I should do that right now. Where is it? Here, okay. Nope. Uh, actions, refuel. There we go. Alright, should have plenty of fuel now. This is nice, I'm perfectly warm. It's 13 degrees Celsius in here, which is wonderful for this area. Wouldn't mind building a house in here. Let's build a nice little house with some lights. Get a generator somewhere, I don't know. Head outside for food, I guess. I'm really confused as to why there's branches of trees in here. That part's very weird. Everything else makes total sense for the most part, but... Oh well. Anyway, that is actually going to do it for today's episode, so thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. Caves have been a nice little adventure, and I hope you'll join us the next one as well. Take care.